Hi, I'm Ed Pineda. I'm the store manager here at Rock and Road Cyclery in Anaheim Hills. And I'm here to show you the 09 Stump Jumper lineup. Um, starting off, we've got the Stump Jumper Comp. This is the base model for the Stump Jumper lineup. And uh, what's, what Specialized has done for the Stump Jumper, they've redesigned it um, since 08. So for the 09, it's a similar design. Uh, but some of the major changes are they went from the traditional shock through the seat post to a now a rocker link design where the shock sits up vertically instead of horizontally through the seat tube. And what this provides you is a much lighter frame, a much stiffer rear end, but you still get the same benefits of the FSR. And what the FSR is, is basically a pivot point that Specialized has put there that disengages the rear axle from the main pivot. So with this FSR pivot, you have a bicycle that's 100% um, 100 active suspension. You don't get any brake jack and you don't have any pedal feedback in the rear suspension. Um, it's been a design from Specialized for the last 15 years. Uh, in my opinion, it's one of the most uh, reliable and uh, best performing rear suspensions. Uh, the frame design also allows you to drop your seat post um, a lot lower than older designs. So the seat tube is now continuous. There's no more, uh, there's no more brakes. Um, with the stump jumper, you get five inches of travel front and back, and that five inches of travel is going to provide you with smooth, comfortable, and lots of control when you're going uphill and downhill. Um, you could lock out the suspension in the front, have it locked out, and have it fully open when it's time to go downhill. And the rear suspension is the same design. You have a lever, a blue lever, that allows the suspension to be active, and then when you lock it out, it's going to be rigid. Now with the Stump Jumper lineup, there's um, a bicycle for everybody. There's about six models that they offer. I'm not going to show you every single one, but I just want to give you a taste of the aluminum and at least a taste of the carbon. And with the Stump Jumper carbon, what Specialized's goals here is to get a bicycle that's going to be lightweight and very comfortable, very smooth riding feel. Aluminum is a great material to use, but carbon fiber is a little bit better in that is it has a better strength to weight ratio than aluminum. So with the Stump Jumper Pro Carbon, your whole front triangle is made out of carbon fiber. So now you're gonna have a lightweight and you're gonna have a smooth bicycle. Uh, you're gonna get the five inches of travel front and back, but the best part of this bike is the fork and the rear shock both have what's called the specialized brain. And what the brain you ask is basically internals designed inside the shock that knows when the terrain is smooth and when the terrain is bumpy. And when, when the terrain is smooth, the suspension will lock out automatically. And as soon as you hit a bump, the suspension opens up by itself. So there's no levers to flip around like we did on the aluminum version. Um, so you've got the brain, it's built in in the front shock, and on the rear, they actually have the brain set up in this little reservoir right here. And there's a hose that runs through here to your rear shock. So that's the beauty of this bike right here. You get five inches of smooth travel, 100% active with the brain. So it automatically locks out for you and it opens up when the terrain gets bumpy. Um, and you have a, basically a total package weight of about 26 pounds. So you have a five inch travel bike, 26 pounds. It's gonna be light going up and it's gonna be plush coming down and it's gonna give you a smooth ride for the whole day. Um, the Stump Jumper line uh, is pretty much the, I would say, the best trail bike around for everybody that's riding both uh, lots of hills and descending, uh, descending lots of hills. This is a great bike you can take to your local loops. Or for us here, we can go up to Big Bear, pay 20 bucks for the lift, take the lift up, and then blast down the hill. And this bike wouldn't, it would handle everything that's uh, offered up in Big Bear. Um, you get hydraulic disc brakes, so the hydraulic disc brakes are gonna be powerful. They're gonna be great for all weather. 
um, and they're also going to continue working if, even if you have a little bit of a, uh, a wheel that's not out of uh, out of alignment. Okay. <laughs>